agile professional and facilitator. You know, what do you want students to take away from their five Saturdays learning experience? I believe the future is about getting things done and knowing how to get them done. It's a life skill that is going to to be more valuable than they probably ever realized. Do you see a value in teaching agile skills to young children as a life skill? When you deal with corporations, executives, or different folks that I deal with, they've learned all these habits and patterns and skills that are contrary to getting things done. So the idea of being able to get them as young as possible. <laughs> yeah. Don't let those habits of you know trying to be, you know, trying to have all these workarounds that people have learned over the years. What have you gotten out of this as a facilitator? What have you learned? So dealing with kids again, well one, it allows you to go, wow, um, because you have to speak to your audience as you yes. know. Yes. And the audience is so different. So what I got from it is I need to get out of my own head again, again and again and start to look from the other person's point of view so that I make sure that the message is really being received by that other person. And they're kids, they're, they're high school kids, and they're yeah. younger now. I'm really blown away by the fact that um, you know your two younger kids are here and they're assimilating really well yeah. with, the, with the high school kids. Yeah. Now, well, did you have some uh, reservations about that? A first? lot. The method still allows them to collaborate. Yeah. to create together and to get things done. So it's just, it's like a scientific method that you just, we just pro proved out this yeah. year. You just need to want to get something done and understand what it is you want to get done. And also understand that you don't need to be perfect up front. For wife and children, hmm. what have you learned from participating in a workshop? And how would you apply these skills in everyday life, for school, for work, for chores? Limiting work in progress is such a simple thing. And yet, how hard is it to put into practice in life? Yeah. So for the kids, at first, it was they had a huge Kanban board with a backlog that was huge, and they kept wanting to push their backlog in doing. Of course, they learned the lesson. You can't. So I want them to learn that lesson early on. So the household is about limit the work in progress and make sure you're doing the thing that's most valuable to you in the household. Awesome. Well, thank you so much and, and for coming back for a second year, for giving your time, right. for bringing your wife, bringing your kids. I think it has made a great difference. And, you know, I continue. I look forward for us working together and collaborating on other things as well. Yeah, you can count on it. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. Yeah. All right.